Hey, 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 this is Kurt the Boat Doctor, 2018 uh, Loomwell Striker. Nice boat. Look at all these seats you got in here. Uh, everything works. You got a newer Furuno uh, in a Lorenz HGS7, the Lorenz, uh, probably 115. It's got an hour meter, 703 control box. I checked everything. I fixed the wash down pump. It just had a leak in the back. I tightened up the hoses. Uh, so what we're going to do now is I'm going to just turn all this stuff on. So right here, you got to hit the GPS button right here. Then off to the side, here's where your card would go. This doesn't have a Navionic card in it, so you have to get one of those. Uh, if you want the GPS with your details, like navigable channels, buoys, cans, so on. So right here, you just push on that. Right here, until it beeps. There you go. And then VHF, you push on this until it beeps, and then you push on this until it beeps. Well, that's doing all that stuff. And then I'm gonna come back here. These here are uh, like uh, quick release ratchets. Uh, they can be mounted on the trailer. I put nose to see if they could do that. So the kicker motor, you just trim this baby down. And then I see his flush he had here. It must've broke off the bracket. So he put that there, it doesn't hurt nothing. Here's your bar right here. So when it's cold, you have to go like this and give it like seven pumps, bring it back, go to here, have that choke pulled out. But once I've started it, you can just go to this indentation. And then she's ready to go, put it in gear. Now this is a friction lock right here. So what I can do is set that like this. Go up here. So I don't really need that tie bar. Then hit OK, hit Accept, and this will go to the last one you had it on. If you push in on this right here on the VHF, where the little weather guy is, that gives you the weather. Volumes here. Marine weather for the following marine location. You want weather off, you just push that. Now your, your squelch, you push in on that. That highlights this little bar over here. Push it again in its volume. Now you want to scan. You just push this button here. And then it says scan. Then you push this and then you push that for all and it'll scan. So now what you may want to do on here, we got it on low filter, this is working. We may want to lower those transducers down just a tad. This is working pretty good. I went through all this and kind of reset it a little bit. And then right here, that must be clear cursor. Anytime you see that, you have to put in some mathematics with colored spot depths on it. And we're in like 21 feet of water down view, side view, and my charts. And I put a couple other combos in there for you. So you just hit the power button there. And here's all your info. Like if you want to find tides, you can go to info. There's your tides right there. There's that boat over there. This has got radar. Now, now you can hit transmit right here, and then it's going to transmit. You don't want those numbers there. Just go like that and kick them on over. Now, see, I noticed this. Now, see how I'm not turning. I can help it out by just turning this a little bit. there's that boat straight ahead of us then you exit out of that then you can go into here you can go just to independent charts go like that zoom in and out just by pushing that so see how I'm not getting it right there I'm not getting the bottle I'm gonna to go to high filter right here see if that helps out and there you go, the HF works good. Volume, you can just go like this. So I got it in a high filter now where it seems like it's picking it up. But I would still lower those transducers down. Now on the V, you gotta hit this one over here when that highlights, then you can change your range. That's on 0.25. That's every circle. So that's a half mile. There's a quarter mile. So I'm going to put it at uh, one, two, five. Half mile. That sounds good. Then you go home. 
If I just wanted fish finder, I can do this. And if I just want radar, that's those markers straight ahead. That's that marker over to the side. And that's that boat right behind us. Right there. Right there. Then if you want to see it, you bring that uh, range in. So there's the markers and I don't see anything else in my way, so I'm gonna turn it over here. There you go, and I'd head that way, right there. Nothing in my way. And this is a bridge, there's a pylons. Go home again. Say I just want a GPS. Again, with the GPS, you need to have a Navani, uh, Navionics card for this. They make another one too. I uh, can't remember what it is. But see, this is all you're going to get until you put a card in there. And then you can go over here and you can just do a combo. Which that doesn't do me no good. So let's just go to radar and fish finder. Then here I got a combo set up for fishing. Right here. You got your side scan, down scan, traditional, and then your GPS. Okay, build pump works, nav light. That works. So I'm gonna turn them on. Then you got a light bar up top. I, I can see the reflection. So I'm gonna leave that on. Leave the GPS on. Now we're gonna go to the force down hose. Well, since I'm going back there anyway, turn that like this. Put that there. Kill it. Trim it. Your fuel line fuels back here. So now, see if this is gonna work. Yep, that works. Oh, so there's your markers there, marker there, nothing around us, we're good to go. Okay, and again, low filter, I'm gonna go back to low filter, see what I, I can get. So what this is doing, when I got on low filter, I'm not getting a very good reading, that's just the placement of the transducers. Because this is what you would want to run low filter in shallower water and high filter, see how I'm picking it up right here? A lot better than if I go to high filter. There's still there, it's picking it up. But So let's go to low filter, see what happens there. Okay, so we got that, got that USB port right here, 12 volt power point right here. A real nice, you got a fire extinguisher, horn, spare prop, holder. There's a boot for the canvas. This is partial hard top. See, I can see this pretty good. I'm gonna go to high filter, see what I can see there. I got some up there. But again, that is mainly for deeper water. Yeah, you can see a lot of bait up in there on top. Yeah, and that's working. There's bait up on top of that. Yep, yeah, bait right here. Okay, so that looks good. Now what we want to do is the main motor. Just turn this baby here, fire it up. And we are at 0.5 miles in a, away. So let's go a quarter mile to each ring. Boom. Point one mile, 0.75. That's real close. I mean, as far as reading out. So, there's landmass. So, 0.75 each ring. One mile, we'll go 0.5. That's better. Okay, so then we're going to hit it. Two seconds to plane, that's really good. Tank of gas, turn off the pump, wiper works. We're turning 50 
58, 59, about 38 miles an hour. reading pretty good but this one needs to be tilted down but other than that she runs really good it's good running boat good package for somebody don't you think I think hey where's my root beer no root beer no wonder I'm a little foggy this morning okay so we're gonna go back to low filter here and I'll have him do that kind of BS Turn off that light. Okay, so and then if you ain't gonna use the uh, radar, you just turn that off before you shut this unit off. See how I got that blank spot? That means anytime you see that on one, if you mounted a transducer, that means you got it too high. You need to lower it and get it out, get it towards the motor more than the, on the outside, and it does need a splash guard. I seen the spray coming up over there. I see I'm losing it there, but I still got it over here. So this one's set right. Then you can go like this. You can go like this, and you could adjust size split on the screen to make one bigger, one smaller. Ah, I'm kind of tired today. I don't feel too good. So if this video ain't good, I've got a little under the weather. Hot rain under the weather. Ah, there you go. Okay, then hit that one. That gets you out of that one. So then all you have to do is hit this button here go to the power and that shuts that off and then you can put this screen back on right here then what you do is hit the X to stop that hold this power button here and that shuts that off well maybe you got to hold it a little longer beep there two beeps and then I shut the radar off so then what you do is you just hold on here and it's gonna say three two one zip or shutting down you let that thing shut down, you put the cover back on, and you're good to go. Yep, nice package for the money. Shoot, you can't even buy a brand new $16 pre deluxe. It's almost this price. And you got everything you need. Radar, GPS, sonar, VHF, plenty of seatings, kicker motor, you name it, you got it. Alright, this is Bo Doctor out of here.